Hey there, Jeff here, and welcome to a very special slash probably stupid test episode. Uh, welcome to recording setup version 2.0 test number four. Um, we have not had any luck getting this worked right so far, but I'm hoping this time will be uh, the uh, one that it works on. Uh, there's a better word for that, but um, yeah, so this is down in my clubhouse we've got which you know lovely right look at all this freaking ventilation shit over there Woo! um but we've got the we've got the mic set up we've got the webcam set up we've got the elgato and we've got the ps3 i figured we'd play some uh the wolf among us so let's jump in huh for a short test episode see if we got our all our settings right or if the audio is going to be super off and the recording won't work at all which is how it's been playing out most of the night. Fables, uh, Wolf Among Us is based on Fables, a comic series by Bill Willingham, and it's an excellent series. I highly recommend anybody who enjoys comic books or fairy tales to check it out. Uh, it plays like most Telltale games, where you... You move around in the space uh, and interact with specific objects and people, and then you have four options for dialogue and a timer. Once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fabletown. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago, after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of a magic spell called Glamour, they have protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Bigby Wolf protects them from each other. I think that's what it said. No, it's not. 105 today again if you missed it. A record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Oh, June. It's almost now, June here. And that's what June would be. I should have stopped one of the test recordings because the goddamn so air conditioner kicked on. Humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 God, with 31 percent. Just like the comic. And it is muggy out there. I beat this game probably three or four years ago. Since then, so it's gonna be fun trying to remember how the controls work. Also, shout out to my big sister Sarah. Are you happy I finally got a webcam or a face cam? And also, shout out to Willow. Thank you for letting me borrow your lovely sunglasses. I can't stand the idea of anybody seeing my eyes, they're so fat. I don't have my summer eyes yet. Out some more so they're ready for the beach. <laughs> Sometimes I miss smoking. Most of the time not, but tenement, 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 tenement. South Bronx. Sometime now. Right? No one's sure when. Could be two minutes, could be an ah, it's a frog. Mr. Toad. I'm sorry, Toad. Shit. My bad. I didn't Big mean to be. <laughs> Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I'll get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is so doing. So we're on a drunken disorderly call. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Uh, Cross my arm. So Bigby's job is to protect Fable Town, which means no need not to kick up a fuss. frogs run around, so we're gonna kind of be a dick about it. I'm looking at a three-foot toad in a sweater. I'm sorry, toad. I apologize. That's a problem. Uh, it's... If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as I was that. Make something about you can't my send dad, me up to me my watch this. <laughs> you know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spout goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how, how much it costs to have an entire work? family in glamour? I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. Sorry. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are You'll tied. Expose us all. Right. Right. There's too much at stake. If I keep glancing past Brick it, cost, it's, I'm it's worth it. You don't want me catching you out of glamour again. Oh, Jesus. Fuck it out. See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got it. You're just gonna stand there? Do something, Big B. Before he completely tears gonna, up no, the place. And I'm gonna put I this uh, go cigarette out on your wall. Yes, please. 
Thank you. Yeah, so I'm just checking the capture. The when we did the the punch out test, uh, we were using a different program than we are now. So. Dad, the lights are oh, shaking again. Oh, it's a little baby. What did I say? You want a big bad wolf to take oh, you dude. away? First no. Off, lower your belt. Then get that fuck back inside. And second off, don't be a dick to your kid. I give it 15 minutes before I get a complaint about my voice echoing through the venting up two floors and waking up everybody. Left foot, right foot. Mm, where can I put another cigarette You're out? You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me! Stop, okay. It does not sound like a fun right. interaction going on in there. Let's go. What do we got here? We got uh, we got some matches. We don't need no stinking matches. And this phone is freaking obnoxious. Let's, Take a good look. let's fix this. You know who I am now? Hey, look at me. And let's see what is that? Knock. Get what's knock? Oh wait, ah. did I hit knock or did I hit kick? I hit kick. Shit. God. Damn you! Dude, no way! Whoa, 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 hey, Don't hey! That's the woodsman. You got something on your uh, face. Little Fuck Red Riding Hood talking game. about, you stupid <laughs> <laughs> I'll fucking kill you! Okay, just cool it. We all can right. all right. it. I was gonna say, we can resolve this peacefully, but... What are you gonna fucking do, huh? Fucking rip get your head off. Get the fuck out of the way before first, you get I'm the axe again. Uh, De-escalate the situation. You're drunk, all right? Think this through. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You've got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how yeah, it went last the woods time. Up. This isn't last time. You don't got your fucking axe. <laughs> there we go. Did I get it? Oh, gotta calm down. Uh, let's go sing. Sing. <laughs> The thing is that whoop shit. I had the right button in the wrong direction. Hit him, hit him. There we go. Oh, fucking blood for punishment. Hard parts, anyways. Uh, you know what? You you need an education in proper manner, so go to the Back off, asshole. We threw him over. Whoop, down. And no fun hands him without you. You should probably get out. So of they can take that Look, because I'm the not leaving the, until I get the, what's mine. You're not getting is the shit more rich. famous a fables oh, story is in put you in the our world. Um, you hear me? Hey, if you can't be nice, I'm gonna make the more you wait famous outside. Their story is the harder oh, they are to kill, the more powerful shit. they are. You vogue my Obviously, jaw. Little Red Riding Hood. Is a pretty famous fucking story. Still, you talk. Fuck you. Fuck you. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Don't worry. You I was the all best the best. best There's bits. more where that came from, girly. Knock it off. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. Yeah, because I just need the money so he great. owes me, then I can go. Are you all right? I'm hunky dory. 
Thanks for asking. Uh, are you hurt? Seriously, I need to know if it's you're for okay. Fighting purposes. He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Did he then pay he you showed for up, beating? started beating on him. I'm sorry, that was bad. That about cover I apologize. I'm the witch, my oh, boy. God. I hate me. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this hey, fucker, fucker open is our word. and filled okay, his you don't belly get full of That's stones word. and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid me, bitch. Uh, would you excuse I just need me to for take a out some trash. By all means. Kill him. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. The lamppost and the car. Ouch. God, I, I'm really hoping all the audio and everything syncs up correctly on this. Ooh. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You can do it, PS3. You just keep chugging along and load this game up. You can do it. Come on, you can do it. What's going on? How are we doing? Mm. I think we froze it. I think it froze. Mm. All right. Hold on. All right, we are back, and I made a slight adjustment to the volume, so let's see if this is working now. Oh, yeah, that's right. We fell on a freaking taxi. How's the woodsman now? Uh, oh, God. Anybody catch my ball? <sighs> Shit. Wait, I... That was a terrible joke. <clears throat> hey, Toad. My God. Oh, shit. It's yours? Yeah. <clears throat> Give me a second. You got a light? Or a cigarette? No, or alcohol? No, or anything? All means. Take your time. <laughs> How's your insurance? <laughs> so, uh, how good is your insurance? Told you, and you come to help. Well, that's I awfully understanding mad. of you. That's real nice. You help, things end up more fucked than they started. Oh. Never mind. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Oh God, it's still up. <laughs> you're ruining this movie, boy. Oh, come on, get him, get him coming, get him coming, Zion. Do it, just jam it. Oh, X, 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 X. X. <laughs> There we go. Oh, not I know you're fucking in there. Come on, on out, you fucking dog. I'll put you out of your misery. Shh, my is so tired. You fucking mongrel. You with your oh, come on. fuck. Go. Come on out of wall. Oh, ooh, there we go. <laughs> oh, he's going to feel that in the morning. He's going to feel that in the morning. Hey, you pretty lady, how's it going? Did you, did you just axe him in the head? Oh god, it's still going. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm just getting what he owes me. You alright back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth? You're not really supposed to do I mean, that, I'm right? okay. Not if I can avoid it. Shit, just laundry oh, tokens. The guy's got an axe in his brain. <laughs> He's not feeling that. It's more for me. He'll be oh, fine. By all means, then. Go, you, go ahead. You fucking bitch. That's not oh, how you talk to a lady. I'm just gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna let her. Guy's having a bad day. That makes two of us. Yeah, he didn't get punched by a dude his size. I guess it's so. a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. God, this game is so pretty. Give me that. Give me that. I want it. Mine. Mine. Hey. 
Hey, hey, wait, wait. Do you like, do you like axes? I've got this. Oh, uh, never mind. I knew she wouldn't like an axe. What am I thinking? <laughs> Just come on. Uh, oh, matchbook. We've got the matchbook. Here. Solving puzzles. Thanks. I don't know why I keep looking at the microphone instead of the camera. Yes, I do, because I'm unprofessional. Who do you work for, really? These lips are sealed. Oh. Sorry. Uh, shit, did I miss a thing? My phone went off. Hey. God damn it, you I like did, my ribbon? I? Um, yeah, it's a very pretty ribbon. Beautiful. Thank you. Oh, she doesn't seem super happy about that. Should I have said it's not a nice ribbon? I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Oh, jeez, he's gone. Okay. Uh, that's not good. Shit. You know, I think Stop. the cab actually looks we better. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already this is. This is about Fable Town. Not just about you. I can't have him running around the city in the state he's in. Opening in the vent right there. I really I need to block it. I was just starting to worry. It was all about Sarah, me. Sarah, my wife Sarah, if you're watching this, I Not apologize. What I mean. Oh, come on. I know you got a heart of gold, Bigby, but don't don't give her all your money. Because you know we're not going to have any other money, and we're going to need it for something. And, like, I, fine, give her the money. I can't play Paragon, people. I can't. Or, I can't play Renegade. I can't. I always play Paragon. 20, 58. That's all I got. Uh, no, not really. Take it. My daddy's okay. going to beat me. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just... Take the money, okay? Do it or I'll fucking hit you. You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off. <laughs> what it's I not much. Meet me back at my office then. It's a little late for an office visit. I mean, it's only slightly after midnight. Ooh, an apartment? Yes, please. How do you know where I You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows Well, that. gee, I'm glad it got around. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. <laughs> Tell me what Sometimes you really think. Pretty bad. Wow. Tell me what you really think. You're an asshole. Hey. I need <gasps> she is going to tell us what she really thinks. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone oh. says you are. Ooh, that looks like it would have hurt. That was like right on that pink scratchy area. I'll see you around. Yeah, at my apartment where you're coming, right? You're you're gonna um, I'll see you there. Lady of the night. Night prowler. I'll stop now. Wait, we had a Zippo that whole time? We could have kept the matches and just lit it with that. Bigby, you idiot! Excuse me. And welcome to the, um, the walking montage portion of the game, everybody. Bigby walking against some paisley with the title. There's Bigby walking against some windows. I'm purple, da ba dee da ba da. Now I'm blue, da ba dee da ba da. I'm in the alley, da ba dee da ba da.
last time I had this many lights on down here in the clubhouse. Episode 1, Faith. I think we can take over again. The Woodland Luxury Apartments. So the Woodland Apartments is the main place where most of the New York Fables live. Fable Town encompasses like a, a block or a two block radius, but most of them live here. There's a couple shops with apartments above it that the other ones live in. Um, is Does anybody, anybody care about this at all? What's this we got? Luxury Apartments. Which apartments yeah, I bet that? you that gets a, a lot of unwanted... Uh, Tenant applicants. Way to lock the door. Just fucking let anyone in nowadays. Like the big bad fucking wolf. Alright. Looks like we've got some options to look around. Let's go over this way. Oh, wait. Nope. The game's gonna... <gasps> it's a flasher! I see you, flasher. Don't make me come over there and get flashed. Don't make me come over there. Look, I've got an hour of paperwork ahead of me, and I've already had to do it. <gasps> it's one a lady flasher. Night, so, just. <sighs> Sorry, Bigby. Didn't mean to be an asshole. And judging by the pants, it's just a, a waist up flash. Hello, Bigby. Did that, did that register? I wasn't expecting anyone. Out pretty late, I huh? Know, this looks a little That's odd. beauty, I believe. You're out pretty late. Wait, did I already say it? Is there some sort of curfew I don't know about? What's with the third degree? Damn it. I'm For not. a very important date? Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw Um, me. no, I am not getting involved in your guys' you Oh, it's an option. Shit. It is, okay. Then. I'm not Look, getting involved, yeah. Whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying uh, out of it. Uh, hold on. I can hear the friggin' dog licking at his empty bowl. I don't have time to go into it right now. I'll explain it all to you later. I will. I didn't I ask you to, to explain. I don't want it. I'm staying out. You're just being more suspicious. It's not what you. Might That's be even thinking. extra suspicious. Maybe cool. I don't know. I don't care what she's saying. I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> Ollie's coming to visit. Hey, Ollie, come here. Come here, buddy. Come on. Ollie, can you say hi? It, nope, nope. Say hi. Oh, Jesus Christ. He burped in my face. Oh, God. Oh, dog food burps. Ugh. What do we got here? We got the... Oh, guard. I think this is Grimble. I think he's actually... Looks like a human. I'm pretty sure he's actually like a troll. A bridge troll. Uh, let's wake him up. Hey. You wink? Hmm. Probably for the best. And we got a suit of armor. Hello, suit of armor. Flycatcher needs to dust this guy. Flycatcher uh, is the, uh, the frog prince of frog prince fame. Fame. Um, the the idea behind that nickname is that uh, after he was turned back into a human by True Love's kiss, uh, he could never really get over the taste of flies, so he's still constantly catching and eating them. Um, obviously, that would give away, you know, that'd be like, hey, red flag, there's some weird shit going on. Uh, so Bigby is always charging him with minor infractions of the law, and essentially, uh, he does all the janitorial work for free to pay off all those charges, which sounds like an asshole move but when you know the whole backstory it's really not he's doing him a favor whoop no come, mm, come back buddy Ooh, hold on can he navigate all the cords can you navigate the cords oliver 
Um. Hey, buddy, come this way. Come on, go around. Come here. Okay, yeah, you just maybe stay there. Sure. <laughs> my dog being comfortable is more important than my professionalism. Or views, or algorithms. And honestly, fuck the YouTube algorithm. I'll play what I want, damn it. Did we push the button? Push the button. We did. It's just a slow ass elevator. Mm, goodbye, sleeping guard. You are ineffectual. Oh, who's this? Oh, that's Beast. There's Beast. Hey, Beast. Big B. Staying out hey, of it. I'm not. Wait nope. Up. Got nothing to say Have to you. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? I saw nothing. Staying out of it? I'm staying out of it. Out of what? Whatever it is, Beast. I'm not a marriage counselor. Damn it. I'm not certified for Something's it. Something's going on. It's so difficult to get comfy on this couch sometimes. Jesus. Sweet home. <laughs> oh, jeez, the place is a sty. Should have cracked a window. Uh, when I lived in Milwaukee, I lived in an apartment that had, uh, at night, it was constantly flooded with the uh, light from the neon signs across the street. Uh, wasn't great for sleeping, but honestly, like, I kind of loved it. I don't know why, but, like, it was really soothing to me. Uh, what a night. So I'm guessing we're gonna find some moldy Thai food in the fridge and, like, beer, and that's it. Oh, no, it's like, uh, Hungry Man meals or whatever the hell they're called. How about freezer? Anything moldy in here? Nope, it's just overfrosted and <laughs> an empty ice tree tray. Ugh. I was expecting worse considering the state of that fridge. What do we got? What do we got here? Uh, Bluebeard folder. Oh, so Bluebeard, uh, obviously Captain Bluebeard. Um, famous pirate. In the comic books, he, when all the fables were fleeing the homelands, uh, he was basically charging them safe passage to Earth on his ship. Uh, he, somehow he had a magic flying ship that could travel between... No, it, it found a gateway between it, and the ship could fly through it. Uh, but he was charging, like, all the, you know, like, uh, S Snow White, uh, Rapunzel, any of, like, the fairy tale royalty, he was charging them, like, basically their entire fortune for safe passage. So... They come to the New World with nothing, and he ends up just loaded. And also, he's an asshole pirate, so... Fuck him. Bluebeard's file. Never trust because he's an asshole. Uh, oh, there's our Thai food! They called it. I'm gonna count that as called it. Chinese. I'm sorry. Chinese. Never ordering that. Don't even. <laughs> Jesus Probably Christ. Probably Oh God. Ugh. Yeah, we definitely need to turn a fan on then. Should help. Should help with the nasty uh, Chinese food smell. Uh. Oh, hey. Speaking of the three little pigs, there's one of them. I think this one is Colin. I think he's the youngest. He has a, uh, a history or a habit of escaping from the farm because he's a civilized pig and he deserves the city life. And he usually sneaks into Bigby's apartment somehow. Uh, let's poke him. Can we poke him? We can poke him. Oh, hey, Bigby. <laughs> Talking pigs are funny. I'm in your chair, huh? Yeah, you are. I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. 
So I really like Colin from the comic books, so we're gonna try to be nice. Like, I get it. If it weren't for Bigby being able to appear as a human, which is not a glamour, that's a whole other thing, he'd be stuck up at the farm too. Got a smoke? Yeah, what does it look like I've got? Oh, are you asking for one? Could say please. I do like my bacon smoked. Thanks. A couple thousand more of these. We'll be well, you should have fucking built it out of straw. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison. A lot of the non-human okay? cables do feel don't like it's send a prison. Me back like there, Bigby. They can't afford it, obviously. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Come on. That's a little dramatic. That was... That for me? Oh, nope. come on, give him... The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying Shouldn't it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused like me, yes. Want, it also would have shown everyone how different you are now. Uh... I just want some rest. That was all you were saying I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Uh, let's make him insecure. Everybody hates me? So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm like doing a true my best friend. Here. Clearly, that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. Why is it steaming if but, it's bourbon? Uh, no, um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anyone. You ate a lot of well, people back in your day. I was a wolf. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories well, either. Yeah, that's a, um... So Bigby's the sheriff of Fable Town, And obviously, you know, he's the he was the big bad wolf. There were a lot of people who did not agree with that. He, you know... Big bad wolf does not get a good rap in any of the stories he's in. Um, but the idea, when everybody came to Earth... Uh, they instituted this policy of general amnesty where any crimes that you committed in the homelands were forgiven because now everybody is in a community together, surviving together, just trying to stay away from the adversary who's the one who conquered, you know, all the homelands. So, um, l yes, legally everything he did was forgiven but nobody's forgotten what he did so like i said it was not a popular decision and he is not trusted by a lot of people look i'm not saying it's fair but it's real people are scared of you i mean look at your hands the woodsman had a fucking axe and he was hitting a girl he deserved it who'd you get in a fight with a fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. <laughs> no, they'd be a smear on the wall. Fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. Yeah, Colin is unimpressed. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being <laughs> bad. Don't say that shit in Love front of Colin. people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude oh, the... that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came no. across tonight. Not everyone, Not everyone. actually. Name I don't, one. I don't know her name. Um, uh, there was a girl. Yeah, I can't say the attitude. Uh, I don't actually know her name. So this sounds... Awesome. <laughs> Great example. <laughs> Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a I don't think it even gave time. me an option to be particularly nice to Toad. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at Snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if Big my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make Just sense. Just give me a drink, please. <laughs> Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. Went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. Oh, look. How's he gonna drink it? Is he just gonna put it on the floor and lap it up? 
Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. <laughs> yes, give him the drink. Somebody's gotta call Bigby on his shit. Who's not, like, above him. Thanks, Bigby. You're welcome. I love you, Colin. <laughs> He's gonna laugh it up. <laughs> God, I hope I'm recording all this. Like I said, really not used to this recording setup. We're flying by the seat of our pants here, people. But, I want it noted, I have not hit the wrong button once. Who is that? Uh, anything new to look at? Where's the Where's the pig? Where did Colin go? God, he's good at hiding when he wants. What's is he over here somewhere? Can't even go that way. Okay, door. Got it. Let me just kind of straighten my tie. Hello, Big Snow Big. White. Snow. Come with me. If you want to live. Snow. Snow. What? Sorry, I'm... What is it? What happened? What happened? I just can't get into it this second. We need to hurry to... Oop, who's... Hi. Hello. Good I'm morning. I'm not sure or which fable that evening. is, actually. <laughs> yeah. Well, on with your business. These walls are paper thin. Then you should have built a better building. We need to be careful. We'll talk outside. And yeah, I can say that because, like, you know, they all live in this apartment building, but they've been in this part of New York for like hundreds of years. So it used to be just a couple of village huts or whatever. God, Willow got the lenses on these frickin' filthy. All I can see is fingerprints. Ooh, what's that? That doesn't look great. That's definitely not great. Way to sleep through everything that's going on, Grimble. What do we got? We have a jacket. Oh, excuse me. And... Surprise! Oh, no! No. You... knew this girl? Mm hmm Is... She's not a Mundy. No. Right? Who was she? I don't know, but apparently 56 bucks was not enough. Working girl. Give her some class. A working girl? A working girl. I, don't, I mean, I'm a working. Oh. Yeah, there you go, Snow. Come on. The woodsman. He attacked her. I stepped in. And he threatened to kill us both. No. We did you put an axe through his skull, though. I don't think anything yet. Just give me a second. It's just. Here. We found her. So, who found her? I did. She was just like this. I didn't. Such a throw the jacket I grabbed over. Grimble's jacket to cover her with. Then, I came to get you right away. No one else was with you? No. Big P, did one of us do this? There hasn't been a murder in Fable Town in a long time. All the more reason we shouldn't start a panic before we know yeah. what's going on. Have a look around. We don't have much time before people will be coming through. Oh, I wish I could burp. Um, head examined. She was placed here with some care. What do you mean? You can see that someone didn't just toss her here. She was deliberately placed. For like us a clue. To find. What kind of monster would do this? 
Uh, that neck looks pretty nasty. That's not a clean cut. Strange cut. What did this to her? What could do something like that? Either something very sharp or something with well, magic. Wait, what do you mean very sharp? It doesn't. I guess it kind of looks clean. I, it's so. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. I did pass uh, forensics in college, but mouth. That's pretty lips you got there. What is? Oh, there's something in there? Okay. <clears throat> oh, it's a ribbon. It's a ribbon. Wait, there's what is that, a ring? Some kind of symbol here. Hmm. I, I don't recognize it. Neither do I. Oop, blood. Let me use my keen deductive senses to examine this crime scene. I'm, I'm sorry. This is just so oh, surreal. God. Um, what, what do you want to do next? Investigate. We well, still have some time. We should be <sighs> investigating the area. Okay, good idea. Uh, we have a ring. Can we? How do I? Can I look at it? Can I? Nope. I just have it. Okay. Um. So. What's up, Snow? Hey, Snow. You all right? Yes. Thanks. But you should hurry. We don't have well, much time. I'm just. We should head back inside. Trying to be polite. Soon. Okay, so I think the blood was this way, right? Uh, that's just going inside. Oh, here we go. What do we got? Blood trail. There we go. Oh God, it's so dark. Uh blood. Drops Lots of, of drops. I'd say it's been here an hour, maybe. <gasps> Is it leading us right over to where Beauty was? Kind of. Scrap of fabric. No signs that it's been here. How would you even... How... How would you tell? Dust? Fabric. Looks like jeans. In fact, it tells me nothing. Uh, we got a trash can. Let's check out the trash can. Maybe somebody threw away a Walkman or something. Just some loose trash. Um, fence post. That's definitely not great. Yep. Well, someone might have hopped the fence, got caught, and left the trail I found earlier. Blood. Still red. Sharp enough. So do we go over the fence or what? What are we doing here? Alright, let's check out uh, the other path. What do we got over here? Anything? No, just a big fat dead end. Looks like it. <laughs> um, uh, how about this way? What do we got? Oop! What do we got here? Look at the bushes. Nobody there. Well, yeah, it's bushes. Why would there? We've already scared all the people in the bushes out of the bushes earlier in the evening. <coughs> <coughs> I am missing something somewhere. And I don't trust going to the door, because that's going to end things, I think. Maybe. Why is it still giving me the trash can? I'm surprised the garbage men can even find their way here. So nothing else. 
there's nothing else to look at, right? Right, game? Uh, oh, duh, give her the clues. Mmm, nice midsection you got here. What are you doing? Better to be thorough. Sure, just hurry up. We don't have much time. Oh, God. Ugh. <sighs> we should move her before anyone shows up. We'll find out more at the business office. She'll be in the books. I'm sure of it. Big P, do you have any idea what's going on? Uh, somebody definitely brought her here. this happen? Why her? Someone brought her in from the outside. That makes sense. There's no signs of a struggle. But how do you know? Uh, blood on the fence? No, blood trail. I found a trail Wait, of blood. Wait, no. I saw it, but... The blood trails from whoever cut themselves on the fence. Damn it. It doesn't mean someone definitely brought it from outside, right? We'll see. Can I give another option? Another thing? Damn it, I should have said the fence. I'm gonna have to tell Crane about this. <sighs> Ichabod Crane. As long as King Cole is gone, he's acting mayor. He needs to know. And he's going to find out anyway, so we may as well get uh... out in front of him. It'll just be worse if he finds out we held it from him. Just wait a little bit. Let I me conduct like some... Him, let me figure out what's going on. our boss. This is part of the job. We also, should Crane wait until we douche. have more to tell him. Right now, all we know is a girl is dead. Telling Crane doesn't change that. I've got all the motivation I need to find out who did this. That sounds reasonable, but... I don't know. I'll think about it. I just don't want him interfering. He's an interferer. Crane's not what's important right now. We need to figure out who this girl was so we can find whoever did this. Take this back to Dr. Swinehart. He can take a look at it. I'll meet you at the business office. You know, I don't actually know what fairy tale or fable Dr. Swinehart's from. It's not all fairy tales. Some are fables. Um, like Paul Bunny and his character, things like that. Hello, people. What are you blind? That looks like handsome Jack from. Uh, I've been standing here a half hour already. You get to just walk in. Borderlands. Must be nice being the sheriff. Do whatever I the fuck you here, like. Dude. I work here. And what great work you do, sheriff. Hmm. That didn't feel very genuine. That looks exactly like handsome Jack. <laughs> fuck. Eh, well, he's not wrong. It's bigger on the inside. This place. I, I... Because you are the one bringing this to me, Miss Snow. The one who so simply stumbled upon this catastrophe on our very doorstep. The last thing I need with Mayor Cole away is a hysteria. Do you understand me? Yes, of course I Don't do. Don't interrupt me, Miss Snow. Oh, fuck. You Ichabod asked me a Crane. question. Don't change the subject. You are to blame for this unpleasantness, Miss Snow. I brought you this news as soon as I could. You no. are trusted it, to keep it, things running you, smoothly around here. Yeah, this Do is not a disaster. If anyone's to blame, it's me. You don't need to be yelling at her. Oh, your role in this is duly noted. Yes, let's talk about and that. And you're mutton chops, Sheriff, you're stupid. You are the one charged with protecting the citizens of Fable Town. Your failure to do so cost someone their life and the safety of the entire community. Don't know that. Tell me you've been doing something. Are there any leads? Suspects? Anything. Anything at all. Any shred of evidence you two know what the hell you're uh, doing. The woodsman's <laughs> right or now. Her I have half uh, a mind to fire the boat up. Shit out of the yeah, woodsman. Her pimp. Her. Was she a. Yeah. She was worried about a money situation. Well, this is just wonderful. Not only is a fable killed, but it was a fable hooker to boot. You two need to get a handle on this situation quickly and quietly. The last thing we need is all of Fable Town knowing there's a killer there's among us. Plenty of killers. Snow. They were just giving yes. amnesty. Sir? Call Vivian right this minute and let her know I'm coming in early for my <laughs> massage. I will. 
Yeah, you've, you've clearly got your eye on the ball. Where is the bottle of wine you were to purchase? Don't bother. Forget it. You can't do anything right. Misogynistic asshole. Do your job, Sheriff. Or we'll find someone who can. <laughs> you know what? Oh, no, Stop. I wanted to say fuck you. We'll get on it right away, sir. You would have just pissed him off more. Yeah, well, I don't care. Well, that could have gone better. Well, I guess I should have listened to yeah. you and waited. Wasn't going to say I told you so. You don't have to say it. It would have been better to have more to offer. Get our ducks in a row. Oh, Crane doesn't like people Fuck smoking. Fuck Crane. Never mind. Ugh. Smoke away. Uh, Crane is an asshole. What an asshole. Yep. That was about an eight on the asshole scale. Asshole scale? That doesn't <laughs> sound right. Oh, it's, uh, is, fucking, fifkin. Is he gone? Bumpkin. Yes, thankfully. Flying monkey from, you can guess what. Oh, and he's got the wine. Awesome. He's an alcoholic. Buffkin! Hello, Miss Snow. Drinking? This early? Where did you get that? It was by Mr. Ichabod's desk. Then don't you think it probably yes, belongs but Mr. to Ichabod's him? Yes, Mr. Ichabod's an asshole. Maybe. I think it's Buffkin. Oh, look at that How smile. How are you today, Mr. Bigby? Not great. It hasn't been a great morning. Buffkin, Buffkin. yes. Sorry. Eh, not your fault. Thanks for asking, though. Buffkin, get the books. Which books? The ones with all the fables. All the books. Not sure that was any more specific. Bring the <laughs> first three. Christ. Be back in a few minutes. He knows the ones I'm talking about. There's bound to be information on her here. If you say so. Somewhere. We'll at least be able to get her real name from the books whenever Buffkin finds them. In the meantime, poke around. Maybe the mirror can help. The I really have to mirror. get this appointment squared away, but let me know if you need anything. And we will, but first, Hello. we're going to take another short break Hi. to, uh, I'm going to double check the audio and see how everything's going. So, all right, right let's jump back into the game. Oh, uh, ooh, we got a lamp. Rubby, rubby, rubby. Oh, there's no genie in it? We're gonna rub it anyways. I'm gonna rub all up on it. Worth a try. Mmm, bummer. Uh, what do we got? We got, um, is this the magic mirror? I think so. Or is this a regular mirror? Hey. Oh, magic nope, magic. Mirror. Okay. I got a question. You oh, God. Ugh. I don't have time for this shit. Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly cruel, but have some I think he has to rhyme it, is what rules. I'm thinking. Mirror, mirror. If you're able, tell me all about this fable. See? Was yeah, that it was. So hard? Yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking <laughs> a hole in you. There's no need for that. That didn't Fine. rhyme. Of which fable do you wish to know? Um. You know what? What about Snow? Show me Snow White. Hmm. Not much of a request. She's in this Shut very. Shut up. I have my reasons. Uh, Woodsman. Show me the Woodsman. Stumbling into a bar by the looks what of it. What you see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be this seen. This seems like some arbitrary bullshit. All right, what's up with Buffkin? Show me Buffkin. Drinking, I'm guessing. Oh, called hey, it. Hey, called put it. Put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. Supposed to be bringing us books, you little 
furry asshole. Uh, I don't know her name. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help I feel like that should be, I cannot help you. All right. Uh, why is Woodsman still highlighted? Show me the Woodsman. Oh, yeah, there you go. That was pleasant. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else. Or someone I will. Else. Just you wait. Come on. Oh. Smooth. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. Thank you. Bit of advice, people. Never ask Snow White about the dwarves. She does not like it. So yeah, uh, the mayor of Fable Town is King Cole. Um, for whatever reason, he's not in this game, and uh, this game takes place before the comic books. Uh, he's not here for whatever reason. I can't remember his official position, but King Cole... Uh, um, I'm sorry, King Cole. Ichabod Crane is acting mayor while he's gone. Um, and Snow White is right below him. Uh, Ichabod ends up being a giant asshole and uh, does not feature prominently in the comic books, let's just say. Uh, Snow White ends up taking over his job and then basically King Cole's sort of a figurehead while Snow White runs everything. Uh, tarot deck. Ooh, let's... Sarah, this is for you. Tarot cards. Jack brought them back from Appalachia. Who knows where they were before then. Or what he did. He sucks some dick! <sighs> what do we got? Strength. I guess it comes in all forms. So we have the wolf, obviously Bigby, but... Uh, the strength of the woman to embrace the monster. So who's the woman there? Is it Snow? Or is it the girl? Oh, okay. I don't even know what that card is. How about number three? Jesus. Okay, so we had strength. We had what were the other two? Can I look at them still? No. So we had strength. We had what looked like a girl at the bottom of a tower, and then we have a dude stabbed with a bunch of swords. Lovely. Um, what else is there to look at? Nothing that way. Okay. And. Buffkin did drop all the book. Oh, that's where he is. Okay. So, that's where we need to go, but I want to look around a little bit first. Just make sure there's nothing else to see. Because that's how we do it at Jeffrey Gaming. We look everywhere but where the plot wants us to go first. Unless we're fucking up. Okay. So, we've got a book open right here. Let's check this open one. We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these. So it's a book of fables, is what you're saying. All right, so let's start. Okay, here. Let's start with our bibliography. Or autobiography, I'm sorry. Me. So we got us. We got... Who do we have? Snow White. Like I said, those dwarves look fucked up, right? You do not ask her about the dwarves. And they do look fucked up. I will leave you to draw your own conclusions. I'm looking at the microphone again. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be me. Yeah, dwarves. I said about that. See? Uh, and Woody? I'm Woody. The Woodsman? Yep. And his axe. Uh, Red Riding Hood. Who is not in Fable Town? That ends up being a major plot point in the comics. Uh, this is, I think, this is okay. So we have uh, 
the Beauty and the Beast right here. So Beauty. Beauty. Happier day. And there's the Beast Mask. Mask, quote unquote. Beast. And a man. <laughs> so. Funny. It is funny because. Um, Beauty and Beast are one of the few fairy tale romances, you know, like from the Disney movies or whatever, that are still married to each other in the comic. Uh, however, the it's a little complicated. Um, Beast's curse, like yes, Belle truly loved him. She broke the curse, but now anytime she gets upset or angry with him, he turns back into the Beast. So it's this. <laughs> They require a lot of marriage counseling. <laughs> it's, it's actually... Oh, wait. Pigs. We got three little pigs. Colin and his brothers. Uh, who do we have here? What is this? Okay, wait a minute. We've got... Okay, so Toad. We know Toad. Nice hat. And that's Badger. I haven't seen Badger. Because he's at... Her. He likes yeah. his privacy. Also, he's at the farm. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. What is that? Is that Ichabod? Ichabod Crane. Scared oh, yep, being chased by the... What's yeah. that? Your boss. His finest moment. Imagine known, being known forever face. for being afraid. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Not that that excuses him for being a giant asshole and a misogynist. Can I? I cannot stress how much of a misogynist he is. Read the books if you want to. If you want to know more. All right. So we got. That's it. It's just this king dude. What do we got here? I've seen this before. Have you? This symbol on the man's clothes. It's the same as. The oh, the ring we got. Okay. Could be her father or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. We will have it. Is that there? Okay. I gotta I have to figure out these camera ratios. Or some other thing where having the microphone and the camera on the same stand, uh, probably not gonna work out. All right. Yes, look. What do we got? Ad Patrius. What is this? Not great. What? I can't read <laughs> any of this shit. I can help. Can you? Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Bubkin, translate. Hmm. An exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Really? Toad? They probably wrote this in I was going to say, Toad does not have the attitude of anybody who's ever had that kind of wealth. That looks like straight up uh, Yggdrasil. Um, Virtue Soleus. So this is uh, Cinderella over here. What do we have? Um... Well, there's our ring, but let's, uh, do we have anything else? Can we go, nope, just the ring? Just the ring. This is the one. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alerlyro? Alerlyro. Alerlyro. That means every kind of fur in German. Oh, it's a German fairy tale. You know that's gonna yes. have a happy ending. What does it say? Donkey Skin Girl, also known as Donkey Skin, also known as <laughs> Ass Skin. <laughs> Be serious, a girl is dead. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. I provide the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful Already, girl in the kingdom. Already, essence is going to get fucked up. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... His daughter, Faith. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. 
I'm gonna attack the Not young. anymore. Should I mock it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Oh, God, that's sad. That is literally officially sad. And what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Her name's Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than her we... name was Faith. Yeah. You should talk to the husband. Especially if she's working did? as a, you know, lady of the night. No, I don't. But we need to let him know about his wife. Yeah, I feel like he's not a suspect. Um... If he saw through her magic disguise, like, he's got to be understanding enough to be like, yeah, you're in New York. Shit is hard. You got to do what you got to do. Is that everything we have? Is that it? Are we done? What are we doing? Oh, wait. No, we have her name. Let's go ask. Let's go ask the mirror. I'm pretty sure Frankenstein's head is under that purple cloak. Pretty sure. Frankenstein's monster's head. Um, what is... What is that? Um, oh, we're going to ask him about the tarot card. Okay. You know what this means? Tarot is a backwards art. I wouldn't put too much stuff That doesn't rhyme. Not when you've been so helpful. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear that also as doesn't clear. rhyme. You're breaking your own rules. Can I ask again? You know what? Oh, same means. thing. Tarot All right, skip. Can I skip? I, I can't skip. <laughs> it won't let me skip. Not when you've been so helpful. Prevision's muddy. I'm as clear. Actually, as you're a mirror, so you're not. All right, let's talk. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. <laughs> of which fable do you wish to know? Faith. Oh, God, we got everybody. Okay, um, Faith, yes. Show me. Show me. Please faith. don't let it. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, <gasps> she said the are same thing. Sealed. And also, why would they need to hide a dead body? These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Vicky. It's simply the way this has to like, be. Like, who needs to hide a dead body from magical eyes? Uh, Faith's father. Show me the Faith's fucking father. creep. The old king. Okay, yeah, I'm happy with that. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. Or does it? Prince Lawrence. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Oh, that doesn't look. Great. What's he been doing? Yeah, that looks really bad. Where is this? Where's what? Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably <sighs> relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Yes, please. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah, that'll have to do for now. Come on, we're going over there. Leave it. It can't Sorry. be good. Leave it. Leave it. That. Ugh. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I. He is. Hold on, Bigby. Why? Bigby, it's me. Oh. Um, you there? What do you want? Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woods with oh. things. Get over here, Big B, before he. Oh, wait, hang oh on. shit. Um. Boy, shit. Hey! <sighs> what was that about? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway to search for uh, a partner. Shit. 
Toad might have to wait. I hate decisions. <laughs> Whenever you're ready. We are ready. Uh, we just need to make a decision about it. What do we do? What do we do? So Toad might be in real immediate danger. The prince looked like he was chilling out in a chair, but it also looked like he maybe cut his wrists or something. Uh... Who knows, maybe the game will... No, no such luck. There? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. Well, where to first? <sighs> okay, um... Big B, shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. What do we want to do here? Um. Shit. Toad's got a kid. We're going that way. I think, right? But if Lawrence is already bleeding out, and it kind of looked like he maybe cut his throat, or his wrist, or something. Um. Give me a second to think about this. Okay, so I'm gonna say Lawrence look there was a bloody knife on the floor and he was reclined in the chair. It looks like he cut something. Toad just said there was somebody tossing the apartment upstairs. What was that? Okay, we're gonna try and save Lawrence. It, that looks like the more immediate thing. Toad doesn't seem like he's in any immediate danger, so. We need to tell him about his wife. He deserves to know. You're right. Yeah, or and whatever they're saying, whatever their excuse is, but that definitely looked like he cut his wrists. We'll have to. Come on. Load for me. Don't freeze up again, game. Early morning, South Bronx. Lawrence's apartment. Bum, bum. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick Front to door, it. Front okay? door, got it. Just humor me. Um. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Huh. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. And if he objects, we are here well, on Snow official trust us, I like that. business, and we can be persuasive if necessary, or you can. Yeah, I'll be the persuasive one. Don't worry. Um, what do we got? Hello, knock, knock, knock. Publisher's Clearinghouse. We have a big oversized check for you. Can I break in, maybe? No. Lawrence, you in there? All right, let's find another way in. I think I saw some windows. Anything else, anything else to look at? No, junky. Besides junky graffiti. Can I talk to you, Snow? No, okay. Um, I did. What do we got? This 
got those blackout curtains. He's probably recording Let's Plays. Hey. Hey. That's not a great sign. All we right. may be too late. We may have made the wrong sure. choice. Guess we're out of options. Come on, help me up. Oh. Jesus. Oh, yeah, we were definitely too late. That makes two people's dead. We need to figure out what the hell is going on here. Who would do this to them? Well, it explains why he's dead, because I've never heard of that story, so... Yeah, could die much more easily. Time to examine the crime scene. Jinkies, I found a clue! Knife, yeah, we want to <laughs> definitely... What do we got? Sharp. There's blood on the blade. Is that the same knife you yeah. saw in the mirror? Yeah. I don't know why it's over here. Well, it looks like his hand's being held over. Why would oh, someone want to kill him? Over. There we go. So he probably dropped it and it... Bounced? No, that doesn't... What? Okay. Um, blood. Strange. Hard edge to this pool like was here and got moved what could it be <gasps> maybe that um let me touch it I want to touch the blood <gasps> okay so maybe we're not too far behind everything um bullet hole what do we got there I just saw a knife. I didn't see any. Bullet passed through the chair. Through the chair? Did he shoot himself? Let's check out the late prince. Oh god, that's a lot of pills, too. Uh, what do we got? Let's. Pills first. What are they? Lorazepam. Prescription sleeping pills. Um. I was about to say a uh, stomach acid medication, but I can't think of it. <laughs> Damn. So did he cut his wrist, or? Because that looks like it's more in the palm. Dry. Like a bar in the south on a Sunday. That left him. So he shot himself. Then what does shirt. the knife have to do with it? Then they never really look peaceful, do they? He. I the blood's know. still sticky, but he looks like he's been dead quite a while. Uh, what do we got here? Oh, gun. There we go. Okay. <laughs> what is it? This gun wasn't fired recently. Oh, Jesus. How Maybe is his blood ago. still sticky? More. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. There was something else over here. What do we got? Shell casing. There we go. No. There's... Oh. Matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. Well, way to ruin the fingerprints on that. Is that all we have, right? Oh, fan. Um, do we really want to turn this off? Fuck it. Let's do it. That doesn't really help. Well, then we'll turn it back on. No, we won't. Okay. Anything else? Nope. Uh, let's see. The blood we already looked at. 
Oh, it's one of those fold-down beds. Right? Oh, son of a... A secret note. Dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. If this was for the best, I'll see you, again. you No, I mean, you won't if you but killed yourself. That's sad. I should know his face. There are so few of us. I should know his face. Don't oh, Oh my god, Bigby, he's alive! <laughs> Jesus, how? What? What are you doing here? Let's get you back up. What was in those pills? Oh. What are you doing here? I saw you in a mirror. What's going on? We found you here, in your chair, with what we thought was a fatal injury. We should call Swinehart, have him take a look at you. Wait a second on this, no. Hold on a second. I will be right back. I have to check some uh, real life grown up stuff. Hold on. Never mind. False alarm, I think. I hope. You know who I am? <laughs> yeah, you better. Yes. Good. I have a few questions. What? What? What's this about? Uh, when was the last time you saw your wife? When was the last time you saw your wife, Lawrence? I. I don't know. A few weeks ago. She came by to get some things. That's what she said. But I, I think it was so she could leave some money. Doesn't sound like your marriage was great. Until later. We've been separated for some time mm -hmm. now. Lawrence, what did you do? I made a decision for us. It felt like Jesus, you look like shit, man. So I shot myself in the heart. Oh, oh he's so he's just been now. dying for a couple weeks. It Jeez, hurts. fucking hell. Your heart's actually a little more to the center. Probably hit a lung. Great. That's what you get for not going to medical school. Uh, at least that's how I think it happened. Things are a little fuzzy. I thought it was a bad dream. The gaping chest wound didn't give it away? Why did you do it, Lawrence? Because he's a bitch. I did it because I was ashamed. I, I couldn't live with myself, knowing I had done What'd you do, or? Oh, they look so happy. I did what I could to keep her away. But she still worries about me. She comes by. Make sure I'm okay. I'm a fucking bird. <laughs> I'm useless. I don't want her to have to worry about me anymore. She's well, clearly shooting that. herself didn't help without the situation. Me being here to drag her down. She deserves that. She's been through a lot. I just wish I could have done better by her. Um, shit. Uh. Uh. Half truth, your wife is missing. Go away. I'm not gonna. He killed himself. I'm not wife gonna tell him. Missing. What? Oh, no. 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 No, no. Hey, no. you're making assumptions dude, based on happen. what was admittedly a lie. Fuck, Georgie. Georgie? Like from it? Lawrence. Oop, what do we got? <gasps> A visitor. Do you? Are you expecting anyone? We'll see who it is. No, wait. Oh shit, they got a key. <laughs> we need to know why whoever's out there is. Oh no, it just sounds like they have a key. Never mind. I'm an idiot. What do I do? Just play dead. What? Can't move in your condition anyway, so just stay still. 
The second we figure out what they're here for, Bigby will arrest them. Or bite their head off, you know. Think about your wife. Give me back the gun. Oh, Jesus, okay. Wait, is, is it loaded even? Yeah, let's hide in the closet. That'll. Intruder. I'm kind of afraid to push anything. I don't know who that is. Just stay quiet, Lawrence. So I'm assuming we have to jump out at some point. What are you doing? Oh, excuse me. Come on, turn around, turn around so I can grab you. Fuck it, we're doing it now. Hey! <gasps> Stay here! <laughs> I thought he was gonna open the door. No! I, I, like, it was right in front of us. What the hell? It looked like he was right in front of us, and then he was off to the side. What the fuck? That's not my fault. Fuck it. We'll catch him. Hopefully. I plan on it. If the game loads. There we go. Come on. Hey, stop! I'm assuming you're Georgie. Leave me alone! Oh, get it. Oh, that's fine. Oh, fuck. Yeah, miss me. Nope. Oh god, that one didn't. Come on, go 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 God. That was awesome. Yeah, hey. you landed on him. How is he getting out first? There we go. That's better. Ease up, Bigby. We're on the Are same we? side here. You son of a bitch. Make me. God what damn you for making me exercise. Who are you? What? Who are you? Listen, man. I'm a private investigator. <laughs> sure. You look like it with that private investigator hat. You're looking for the woodsman, right? My employer is looking to Am ask I? a few questions too. Hit him. The you fuck? sound like you're giving me what I want to hear. Dumb. Dumb? <gasps> yeah, it is. Well, it can be much easier for you no. to... Tweedledee and Tweedledum. He's dumb. Oh, fuck. Oh. <gasps> Ow. You almost looked peaceful. Uh, are you an angel? You look like an angel. I feel like Except a hangover. You're lying in a dirty alley. Yeah. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yeah. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you, and the other one finished killing <coughs> then they jumped into a car and drove off. Huh. Where'd they get the car from? Come on, get up. How's Lawrence? How's he doing? We should check in on Toad. See if there's what anything about there that can get us back on the trail. I swear, like, he was right in front of where the camera was. I thought he was going to open the drawers and find us, and... I don't know, fucking stab us or something. Here's hoping nothing bad happened to Toad. I 
How's that capture doing? And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Just yeah. of that one apartment. Looks worse in the day. See, his car's I fine. I don't think anybody's here. We came all this late. We may have made a bad decision in not coming here first. All right, son. All right, he's gone. He's left. It's over now. Or maybe not. It sounds like they're at least alive. Which is maybe more than I can say for Lawrence. Um, anything to... Can I go up? No. Okay. Is that a son? I feel like no. you should handle this, okay. Snow. Be nice on him, okay? All right. I'll try, as long as he's not a giant asshole. Uh, talk. Hey, Toad. You Way in there? Be nice. <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my you bother. You called us. Sorry, Big B. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but... Uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There was it though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got okay. Best now of me. I do definitely hear. Uh, Let's get back to the game. So you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. You heard someone crying. Oh, the boy stubbed his toe on the bed frame is all. Really? <laughs> it stinks, you know, but it's nothing to kick up a fuss about. A little tub swim, he'll be right as rain, I'm sure. Is your son in there? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Let us toes don't, toes don't have little toes. Dead. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off. <laughs> no. Not around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. This is for your own safety, Toad. You called us, remember? Yeah, yeah, I know, and I appreciate it, mate, but... Yeah, he's hiding something. Relax. Be out of here in a minute. I just want to check things out first. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time or something. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. I will. Whatever I like. TJ, are you all right? <laughs> Toad Junior. Oh. There you are. I don't mean to intrude, but Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. <laughs> Flycatcher would. I was wondering if you could, perhaps, let me see it. It has a weevil. Oh, he's so cute. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for. No, nothing. we're gonna tear it all to shit. Sure thing. All right, what do we got here? Smashed lamp. How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off. Mm -hmm. Sure. Uh -huh. The lamp just fell off the table. All the boy was faffing about, playing the salt. Fuck is salt faffing. Who knows what the lad? Uh, busted latch, yes. Your Somebody broke in. Too. This place is falling apart. Huh? A lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking lock's been busted for weeks. And you didn't bring it up last time? Right, just like everything else in this bloody building. Hmm. You're a liar. Tell me what's going on. Let's look around some more. Um, okay, nothing this way. What do we got? You know, it's actually kind of a nice apartment, to be honest with you. Stain. <laughs> but it's just some wood rot. Not mold or mm. anything. You bleeding? Sure. Why? Is that blood? Still fresh. Oh, well, I'll cut me end. 
ran around like a tit trying to pick out a rap. That hand is not cut, sir. Sounds painful. Oi, don't you go mothering now. The wound didn't No, Mother Hen lives in the uh the woodlands, I'm pretty sure. Or up at the farm. I'm not sure. I have no idea. I'm terrible at my job. Uh, what do we got? Um, fireplace poker. With more blood on it? Yes. There's more blood over here. On the poker? Yes, on the poker. Yeah. What happened? Oh, well, that's, that's how it happened, didn't it? Oh, I, was, I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. The like hell would you do if you ever got in, like, a it hit and run with a parked car? With it. Wait, you dropped it on your foot? You told me before that you cut your Caught foot. him in a lie. Yeah, no, I, I did cut my hand. I cut my hand first, and that made me drop the damn thing on my foot. <laughs> a ruinous flip of events. Really, it was a ruinous flip of events. God, would you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything mm -hmm. that happened. Why don't because you you're a fucking me? liar. I mean, things happen, you know. This apartment's a goddamn mess, Toad. Looks like after a struggle or a fight. You're lying about something. But I'm not. And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you. Honest. We'll see. We have more things to look at. Uh, we have. Okay, anything up there? Nope, just the window? Oh, oh, we got some scuffs. Let's open it up. What do we got here? What is it now? If it's blood, you know <laughs> what happened. I no, there's marks here on the window sill. And what's that about? No real reason. Late night date. I didn't want my son to know about. Night when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright That is my British place, accent. As you would be. And I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody mm -hmm. window. You just said the lock was broken. Uh, scared Junior off to death. You said the lock was broken, you big fucking liar. You heard uh, the new... Uh, the Shaking fuck Stevens is Shaking Stevens? Bloody hell, Big B. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left a tap water running. Didn't stop the recycling. What's the point of all this, mate? Really? <sighs> Wouldn't need keys. The lock's broken, so... Caught him in another lie, baby. Huh? Why'd you climb in through the window? You said it yourself. We're gonna castle this ship. Weeks. You wouldn't have needed a key to get in. Fucking hell. Just what are you on about, mate? After the state I was in, I didn't have me head. That's all it was. I forgot the fucking handle was fucking busted. <laughs> sure you did. And I'll tell you with what your money problems, yeah, I bet. You bringing all this shit up. Not to make fun of your money so problems. Quit it with but... a third degree and all that. All right, what else do we have? Is that it, really? Um... Just snow. Let's try talking to you before we talk snow. Place needs a bit dusting. <laughs> yeah. Um, I know you're lying. Toad, I know you're lying about the door. Fucking hell, Big B. I forgot my keys. Can't a grown frog just forget his latch for a bit? This one might have rotted, but it just made the kicking it in part easier. I know you, Toad. Sleep in your smashed up car's glove box before you think to climb in the fucking window. Come on, give it up. Talk some more. <laughs> come clean. Look, you want me out of here, I want out of here. Just come clean. 
What's going on? Place needs a little broom. Dude, I'm trying to be nice. I promised I would be nice. What is it? <sighs> Fine, that's it. I'm talking to talking to Snow. Though most people think they are. Uh-huh. How's it going? Toad's hiding something, but I don't know what yet. Did the kid say anything? No, but I'm worried. He has two huge bruises on his arms. He won't tell me why, and he acted nervous when I brought it up. Hmm. Something's going on. Stay with the kid until I figure out more. All right, did that reveal any new stuff? We still got Toad. Nothing there. Get around, come on, there. Nothing over there. So just Toad still. Please don't make me get tough with you, Toad. I do not want to get tough with you in front of your freaking kid. What is it, mate? Just tell me what's going on. Please don't. There's nothing else to look at. I don't want to do this. Right? There's absolutely nothing else. Oh, what do we got? What do we got there? We got, we found some stuff, maybe? Oh, what the hell was that? What's the other one? Examine. These do nothing. What the... What the hell are those? Are they just leftovers from stuff we already looked at? Did we find a fucking glitch in the game? Alright, time to get tough. I know something's off here, Toad. And I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? I don't know what you want, Big B. There's nothing going on. I don't want to intimidate him, God damn it! There's just... There's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, I did. you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. Big boy's in the other room, Big Oh, Oh, goddammit. Come on, now. No, We're I'm not going to hit right? him. I didn't want to... God damn it. What am I missing? I do not want to... Don't make me do this shit. But I really don't see anything else, literally. Nothing, nothing. A whole lot of nothing. Nothing. Oh, oh, there we go. What do we got here? Shit, I shouldn't have scared him. What you mean? There's a clean space in the dust over here. Ah, oh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, I know. Shit, I shouldn't have scared him. I should have looked around more. Oh, it's the fucking lamp, duh. I completely forgot we hadn't tied that in yet. God damn it. That broken lamp used to be here, right? I'm ashamed. Tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know Power what happens it. in it? Because it wasn't on that table, Toad. There isn't any room in the electric outlets. Huh? What are it you... It was plugged in over here, and now it's there. I, I did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? And not plug it in? Come on, Toad. I just hadn't gotten around to it yet. You see how many damn No, I really there don't. Are? Big B, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this. this then you shouldn't have fucking called. Belongings. I'm sorry I called. Really, I am. But will you please 
please just bag her off. There's something going on here, Not but yet. no. Not yet. No one fought anyone, Big B. There wasn't any scrap. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody own. You tell me the damn, damn truth. You telling me the truth, Toad. Well, I've told you the truth, mate. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? Toad, these stories have made no sense. You didn't cut yourself on the poker. You didn't forget your keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. That's three for three. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? Yeah, I'll say. Oh. Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. <laughs> you dumbass. Take off the hat. Ooh, geez, that's, yeah. <sighs> It was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dumb or D. You gotta strip them down to their Johnnies before you can tell which is which. He come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when well, I said Faith, I didn't like, have it. She picked all his pockets, he didn't have anything but those coins. Him. Maybe he wouldn't have had the nerve to strong arm me boy. He hurt Toad Jr. How awful. What the hell does he care? It's always the same with you, isn't it, Big B? If I'm in trouble, need help, if I call about something, you always take the live long day to get here. Well, Not fair. Worse, eh? I'm tired of feeling trivial, mate. A lot of us are. We're sorry, TJ. Really. We were lucky it didn't go What'd any you tell further. Him? What was he like? Oh, uh, yeah, well, yeah. I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill Well, do him. not worry, because I will fucking rip him he up. He tried to give a bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows <laughs> things for people who live here. Eh, do not. Uh, sometimes swear to God, if you lay a finger on that kid. Steal nothing. Turn I will eat you. you mate. You're merely repossessed what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family... Anyone. All right. Wait, wasn't her part. thing that, like, they made a donkey skin cloak Fine that bit of disguised her? Is that the coat? Is that literally? <laughs> wait, oh, way to get it all dirty and sooty. Ugh. Oh, yep, donkey skin. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. Ooh, we got a clue. Jinkies. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. What do you want to do with it? Um. Don't make it a dilemma. Shit. Ah, uh, fuck, we gotta open it, right? Just open open it. it or it belongs to Lawrence. Um. Open it. I'm sorry. Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. Oh, I hope that was the right decision. Maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood. Well, why? None of us are bleeding. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> And don't worry about what happened earlier. Just feel better, okay? And if you're looking for the woodsman, try down at the trip trap. Trip trap it is. Got it. Oh. I was worried he was going to smack him or something. Oh. All right, Snow, let's trip trap it up. Go that smoothly? Not often. So, split a cab? Sure. I can only go to the trip trap from now anyway. <laughs> I can only go there, because that's only where the game will let me go. Hopefully the woodsman's there. Well, I don't know. 
someone who will know where to find him. It's my best lead. Our only lead, really. When you put it that it way. It is our only lead. Jump. There we go. Got a full on mystery on our hands, people. We got the Tweedledums, we've got a decapitated hooker, uh, a dead husband, a jealous Things John. Get more complicated. All sorts of shit it going on like here. We're always a step behind. Riveting! The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. <laughs> I'm always Vicky? right. Except when I'm not. You. Who do you think did this? I know it's still uh, early, but... You know, I don't I honestly have... Yeah, I got nothing. What do we got? Bluebeard, the pimp, it's previous... I thing. got nothing. I have no idea. I can't tell if you don't know or just both. Say. Uh, thanks for your help. Thanks. I wish there was. <laughs> Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... Oh my god, just bang already. It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to prostitution. I, I wish there was more we could do. But there's not. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Then you should do something about it. You are in a position to make a difference. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are. Like I said, Crane fucking sucks. You really want to help, you'll figure out a way. Oh, she appreciated that. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Oh, excuse me. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was... Come on, hang in there. You should stick it out. There are fables that would give up a lot to be in the position you're in, and I think it's easier to change something from the inside. You're telling me change comes from within. Me. Nee. Sure. If you want to take it that way. Not the advice I imagined hearing from you. I'm full of surprises. And the people I ate. Uh, maybe you should handle this one. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, there's the gutter we saw the woodsman throwing maybe up in. Hold on one second. Big I just beat. want to check the capture. I know I said I was going to check it. Really, all I did was turn it off and turn it back on again. So, oh, let's go. Woo. Face cam is going to be a thing to get used to. Ugh. I, I mm. just be careful, please. Yeah, I mean, you know, I do what I do. 
same goes for you. I will. It's, it's like 2 o'clock in the morning right now, so <laughs> bear with me, folks. The Trip Trap Bar, the Bronx. You know, I like the wallpaper. And the white hair. Oh, hey, it's fucking Handsome Jack. What's up? What do you want, Sheriff? Uh, in the neighborhood. I was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd pop in and say hello. Well, fucking hello. Now you can get the fuck nah, out of here. Nah, I don't think so. Look, I'm not even gonna ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nuts. So try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. Mm, that's not what the magic mirror said. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while. If he's oh, been Jesus, here at you're all, such a bad liar. I don't know. like some help and I'll be out of here well I'd be willing to help you out of here would that help I hear Holly all right what do we got to look around at um what's this matchbook Ooh, matchbook it's the same as the one we had a lot of these walk out the door yeah it's called advertising He get a refund. Fuck you. The word's getting out. Uh, bar stool. What is that? Sit down and talk. Versus cigarette machine. Uh, we got Gren. I think that's Grendel. Of um, Norse mythology. Pictures. Let's check out pictures. Oh, there we go. Mmm, talk to me, baby. Talk to me. Talk to me. He a regular? I don't know who you're talking The guy about. the fucking the picture the you've got. Head and the beard. Never seen him. Ooh, half empty. I mean, it looks. <laughs> I can't tell by looking at that. Someone who left. Someone who left. Why didn't you dump it? Hmm. If you want a cleaner place, feel free to get the fuck you out. You feel of free here. to fuck off. I'm sensing a very hostile tone from you. Don't deny it. I'm good at picking up on this stuff. All right, what else do we have? Uh... Oop, what do we got here? GRH and WD. So we got Gren, we got H and Woodsman. Who's H? Is I'm assuming that's her. Cash only people. A lot of stools in this place. <laughs> There's only one right next to you. You're gonna order something, or are you just here to buy both customers? You know, both. You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. I don't know what that is. Sure. I think they have some at the bar down oh, the street. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> think 
That's funny. Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. It was all right. Come on, guys. I don't want to be here. You don't want me here. The sooner you answer my questions, the sooner I'll be out of your... What was that? Hopefully it wasn't actually a tough shit. Ollie, you're out of paper. There we go. The... How's it going, buddy? Just sidle on down that way. Saved your beer for you. Holly wanted to clear it, but uh, I said no. He'll be back. Now here you are. Oh, look, he's got a little bandit up there. Going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting you. Well, Woody, that makes two of us. Here in luck. I decided to switch seats. <laughs> you lucky, handsome Jack, you. Oh, wait, what? Got a problem, Jack? Look, it's been a long fucking day, and I'm starting to get a little cranky. I've got questions. I'm not leaving without answers. Nah. Maybe he don't want to talk to you. He can Why say, like yeah, exactly. Like that? Okay, Greg. Thank you. It's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know <laughs> who you were. Yeah. Well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> now I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that? Uh, play the hand you're dealt. Not exactly comfortable with it either, but hey. Play the hand you're dealt. Well, some folks are forced to play with your <laughs> shit. That's a lovely image. <laughs> Guess you want to know about the girl. Amongst other things. Sure. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. She had money. I was sure of it. And she wouldn't put up any kind of fight. <laughs> really? Tonight I finally get up the nerve to do it. There you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong Wait, place at you... the wrong time. So, you were planning on you were gonna her? rob a hooker? Yeah. Her and her Whoa, Emma. Wait, what are you talking? Wait, are you about? talking about? Rip oh her. my God. Her grandmother. I was there to rob him, but when I showed up, you were already there, lying in the bed. I only saved her because I thought she might give me a reward. <laughs> she didn't give me shit. You asshole. Except a bunch of people thinking I'm something I ain't. I played along as long as I could. Only thing I managed to get from it was a free drink every now and again. I don't know this story. Yeah, I know thing? what's going on. I already know this story, Woody. You should. Yeah. You were there. I'm not talking about Red Riding Hood. I'm here about Faith. She was murdered. What? Faith? Oh, Who's that? The girl you really? were beaten on this morning. No, 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 no. I, I was here. I swear. It doesn't look good. We did see him in the mirror. Smacking around shows up dead. Well, hours later. Not during though. She's dead. Bigby, listen, I, I'm a piece of shit. Okay, I know that. I hit that girl. I did. I, I shouldn't have, but I didn't kill her. You believe me, right? Well, her head was They're chopped off. Up, Digby. Like you said, it looks fucking bad. It looks really bad, but I didn't do it. You know, he was I, here. Actually, I do believe him. That's the fucking truth, Sheriff. You see? Bigby, please. You can't. They'll throw me down the witching well. That's what Ooh, they'll the do. the witching well. And I didn't do it. 
You know that. Uh oh. Hey, stop! This isn't what you I want. You got a situation brewing. Shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. About this fucking lapdog. Come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Big B? It's not like that. There are problems with the way things go. I get it. But that's got nothing to do with what's happening right now. Molly's sister goes missing. No one gives two the shits hell? about I'll, her. What? Paperwork. Wait. It's first time hearing and about it. Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. I wouldn't call her that. It's happened before, and it doesn't end well. I didn't realize you were. Oh, the bitch yep. This man. There we go. <laughs> No, got I got more. Seem to be enough. Don't I got be plenty. So sure. Fucking handsome Jack. Come on, bring it on. Oh, good. Oh, oh. Okay, yeah, that's less handsome. You should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about uh. me. Oh, fuck. Oh, grab it. Come on. Go. Oh, oh god damn it. Come on. Oh. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, god. Oh, uh, what am I supposed to do here? Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, that did <laughs> fucking nothing. Ugh. Okay, come on. Let's go. Haha. -ha. Missed me. What am I doing? What am I Ooh, get it, get it. There we go. Oh, not right in the eye. Or between them? Ugh. Oh. Come on, Woody. Do something. Come on. You claim to not be an asshole. Come on. Oop. There we go. Let the beast out. Come on. There we go. Ooh. Nobody messes with the big bad fucking wolf. And stab. Oh, scratch, bite, something. There we go. Ooh. A little bit of both. Shit, get him, get him. There we go. Ow. Oh, there we go. Stab. Oh, nope. Arm. Arm. There we go. Stab. Oh, I'm getting confused on where my cursor is. And back to the knee. He's had enough. He's had enough when I say he's had enough. Ooh, uh, let's walk away. I mean, we do know everyone's afraid, and I don't want everyone to be afraid. I'm trying to do my job. Tearing off an arm is not part of my job. Oh, come on, deep breaths. Deep breaths, Bigby. There we go. Whiskey. <laughs> Double. Free beer tomorrow. I didn't notice that until just now. There we go. Ugh. Oh, shit, I can't pay for it. Shit. Uh, Crane. Crane pay for it. Submit a damage report with my office. Fabletown will pay for this. Charge the drink on there, too. And the glass. Don't 
even think about it. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? Well, you haven't attacked me, so... No. If you come quietly, you'll be treated with respect. But if it turns out that you killed that girl, well, you know what that means. <gasps> Is it fucking... I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a Oh, you name. are so fucked. You fat, stupid ass hat having bitch. Oh shit, nope. Okay, we're letting him go. We want. I'm assuming it's a choice here. Yeah, we're we're definitely going after uh, uh, D or Dumb, whichever fucking one it is. Fuck, man, that's not necessary. Yeah, it is. Seeing as how you fuckers knock me out. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on, you're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to. You worry. do have to worry about knocking me out. Possibly, or your brother does. I'm not sure. Oh, I swear. Oh, good. Okay, never mind. Uh oh. What? what <laughs> do anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witch. How's well he gonna myself. do anything stupid tied to a pole, except maybe strip? I don't like this even a little bit. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Oh shit, it's not beauty, is it? Wait, no, she's alive in the comics. It can't be beauty. That's not a great sign. Oh shit, it's snow. I for I mean, I know I said I played this before, but I completely forgot. Oh god. We had something very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you. Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Where's the rest of her? Serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us. Wait, the watchman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. You can't mention Shit, wait. I'll find someone who can. Does that mean the woodsman I chopped her? Wait, that doesn't make any sense. What the? I know she's here. You must have Ooh, seen her. Ooh, beast. One of the getting two beastly. <laughs> <laughs> no, turning over new leaf. Who? What did you do? Friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, Bigby. Is that you? Fuck. That's Bigby in full on wolf mode there. Well, almost full on wolf mode. Uh, next time around, episode two Smoke and Mirrors. And that would be it for our test run. Hopefully everything works out just fine. Oh, we got some...
Did you give money to Faith? You and 84.5% of players gave Faith your money. Okay. Uh, did you tell uh, Beast the truth about Beauty? You and Knight. Okay, I was definitely in the minority on that one. Where did you go first? You and 30.8% of players went to see Prince Lawrence first in the minority there. What happened to Prince Lawrence? Oh, we prevented his death. Cool. Okay, so... Who is your prime suspect? My prime suspect is apparently um, that guy in the middle that I do not recognize. I'm assuming that's the pimp, maybe? Who did you arrest? 68.7% arrested Tweedledee. All right, and we will find out where that goes next time. Hopefully everything worked out on this, and hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I will catch you later.